Despite its restricted membership, the Dallas Police Association's private club has done well since its grand opening last December. 1,500 of Dallas's finest have seen the advantages of having a quiet drink in a nice place without worrying about getting involved in a barroom brawl. The president of the organization, Sergeant Preston Parks, explained to me that a policeman is a policeman 24 hours a day, but also being human, he likes to relax occasionally and listen to country music on the jukebox. The club is unique for Texas, he says, and is one of the few in the nation exclusively for policemen and women. The building, which the DPA owns, has offices, meeting rooms, and a television room where the men about to go on duty can relax without going into the bar. The police code of conduct forbids drinking several hours before and during duty. A game room, complete with a couple of pool tables and a fine pinball machine, provide recreation for these men who are ordinarily patrolling the Lee Park neighborhood. The bar area is handsomely adorned with monogrammed glasses and all the necessary appointments for Huey, one of the few civilians about the place, to stir up his alcoholic confections. He had high praise for his job. Well, I have so much more enjoyment working here than I do in the other clubs. Why is that? Well, one, I don't have to worry about getting robbed, one thing. <laughs> <laughs> and another, you know, I don't have to worry about fights or anything like that. The doorman takes care of all that, you know, if there's ever in trouble. Do the policemen come in and tell you their problems like customers are supposed to do to bartenders? No. No. <laughs> Do you have any idea why not? Well, they don't have problems, I don't guess. One thing missing from the picture were cute little waitresses in short skirts. It was explained somewhat regretfully that the policemen's wives helped veto that addition. The only way an outsider can get into the club is in the company of a law enforcement officer. So if you want a good cheap drink and a safe place, you might get friendly with a cop on your beat. For Channel 8 News in the Move, this is Judy Hanna.